today's the day of me like punk the premiere guys like it's lit like it's a situation and whatever um but oh trust me to have things to do so i'm on my way to uni technically have uni today but like no one cares about that but i still need to go to uni to give my friend a gift for my other friend whose birthday is today birthday aj oh sophia her name's sophia by school aj or safaj yeah birthday to you this is what we do for friendship um because i would have gone to her get together today but like black panther premiere and canning you know yeah so i'm running to uni i'm trying to get an asap give this gift to have some um and have a little bit of a group meeting because we have so many group projects this semester i need to get back hopefully by i told myself 12 but it's nearly 11 so that's not gonna happen um why one because me and my friend on the phone yesterday we did maths and I, I gave myself more time so technically I can be back by one my clothes are hanging I need to iron my scarf but that's cool my nails are not even done my other hand I'm holding my phone with um, my other hand I'm holding my phone with isn't done because instead of me to paint them last night I just went to bed I'm gonna do like gold flex on top no one's gonna really see my nails but I just feel like I can't have to do my nails um, seeing as I can yeah that's me that's me i'll try and catch up with you in the day if i'm not too busy running around um before the premiere oh my gosh i'm going to go to the premiere like it's crazy how like it was a dream to go and then uh, i won a competition like and i'm actually going like i'm actually going i'm keeping my cap my camera battery giant um not drying it's my nails should be drying my cap my camera battery is charging at home because there's no way I'm gonna get his premiere and not vlog it um, and not take pictures on my good camera because if if that camera battery dies the whole premiere has to stop I'm, I'm, I'm serious anyway yeah that's charging at home so me and my friend at the moment these nails better dry I feel like so bad for painting them on the pub on, on the bus but I feel like there's been worse you know and there may be worse later, who knows? <laughs> yeah, so these are tonight's nails. Sponsored by TFL, the underground, and TFL the buses. This is one hand done. My left hand is pretty decent, as in, because it's painted by my right hand, it would be quite neat. The problem is, now I need to paint my right hand, and obviously my right hand is my dominant hand, plus this hand's still drying. So I'll probably do that when I get to uni. I don't know man, I love painting my nails, just don't do it often because you have to remove it. I don't have like breathable um, polishes, but I will start doing this one, inshallah. Yeah. Yeah, my hands, they don't look ashy, but they feel kind of dry, so excuse them if you feel like they look dry too. Um, yeah guys, my nails. So vlogging and walking is actually really hard. This is take four or something. Oof. Again, vlogging on my phone because my camera's at home charging. If it's not charging, I'm actually gonna scream, but I know it's charging. Anyway, I am on my way home from Stratford. Don't know if people can recognize it, but this is Stratford. This is where I'm getting on. Um, let me sit down. Oh God, okay. So I did go to Stratford to get a sample of this foundation. This is my shade warm almond in is this, is this my shade i feel like this is really light i feel like this is really light hopefully this is my shade in my foundation no this is really light this is wrong oh my gosh the whole point of going was to get this sample because i've tried this foundation before and i know it's really good and it will last me the night which is what I need because all my foundations are great and all but they're not like movie premier standard so I've probably just stood there service. nah this better it's be my shade it's not gonna lie I'm eating rice because I'm hungry um and I don't know where we're gonna meet um I don't know how you hijabi youtubers do this whole like get ready with me because I, I tend to do my makeup without my I tend to do my makeup without my scarf on, so I can get like 
you know, my, my seven head and, and you know, just the edges, even though it's going to be under my scarf, it's still messaging me. Okay, and then like that. Um, but yeah, eat my rice whilst I'm just sitting on the floor, I don't understand, and this is like my sibling's room, but this has really good lighting, um, in comparison to my, my room, so I've moved here, sitting on the floor because they're not in. Um, well, this rice not even properly warm, so I might have some poison in sometime soon. Um, yeah, but I'm on my camera. I'm gonna really do. Um, I'm gonna do a quick get ready of me. Um, <laughs> really thought I'd do this. I'm gonna just start off with my shoe butter because my face feels really dry. My lips look kind of ashy, but I know that's because of the light and exposure. But we can't take chances, shall we? Trying to go for this matte look, which is why okay, all right. That's why I went to Stratford to get the um, the um, thingy with sample because I know that foundation is really matte. Um, but my girl gave me the wrong shade. feel like I'm gonna just decide I haven't decided like what I said I'm gonna do it has to be like a subtle thing because my dress is already a statement and I don't want to look tacky um, so I'm gonna just turn this whole thing off um, I'm gonna come back so this great ready for me flopped uh, I'm gonna come back at the end and yeah hopefully I'll show you my outfit and stuff before I leave for two seconds yeah I was shook that I left my camera battery at home like if I did you know the day's cancelled um as you can see I am on the underground because okay because I'm, I'm on the underground because um look at this my dress look at my dress guys you can't see it because my dress is up nothing makes this less embarrassing it's not even embarrassing I don't care but basically um I was considering taking an uber but the uber sorry okay Everyone's looking at me like, what's this princess doing on the underground? Like, should she just get a driver? Yeah, I should have a driver. Yeah, like I'm saying, I was like, let me take an, uh, an Uber because I just want to relax. You know, I'm really overdressed for the underground. Um, and then Google said that if I was to take a car, which is basically an Uber, it would take me two hours. So I just had to firm it and take the underground. And now everybody's staring at me. But. I look good. I did half of this on the underground. Literally, this lash is falling off, it, it seems. I don't know if it's falling off. It looks like it. I could have done the underbrow highlight. I tried to put a bit of plenty there. It didn't really work. Um, but I think I look good. The camera's saying yes. Um, I need to do my scarf. And then um, the Picatinny line. I've changed into my shoes. Because right now, let's do a prep check. <laughs> Right now, it's my dress. That's my dress. And that's my shoes. Obviously, I'm gonna wear my high heels later on. I just can't wear them as I like do this underground thing. I feel so out of place, but I look good. I feel like the foundation that is my right shade, and you know, thanks to this sort of a lady. Um, coming through. I do look quite matte but I feel like it looks good on camera. This is what I was going for. Um, I wish my skin was just smooth. Like, where are the spots? Is that always my right side as well? Like, does anybody know why I'm getting spots on my right side and not my left side? Uh, I'm actually looking really forward to it now. Um, I've gone over the fact that everyone's staring at me. They're staring at me because I look good. These lashes are my favourite lashes. Um, look at them guys, they're so long. <laughs> Yeah, almost is kind of white. I'm basically like Sada going to uni, but Sada going to prom on the underground. But it's okay because y'all not seeing Black Panther, I'm seeing Black Panther, I'm seeing celebrities, and I can travel. 
sons and daughters in the film. Mm -hmm. I want to bring everybody out who we have here. Some we have to leave some folks back back, back where they where they are because some folks were busy, but uh we're able to bring bring out some very important people to the film. Mm -hmm. I want to start off uh um, we'll bring out the beautiful Victoria Alonso from Marvel Studios. <laughs> we got the lovely, lovely, talented, brilliant Letitia Wright. Undisputed best dressed man on set. One of the sharpest actors I've ever met, Mr. Martin Freeman. <laughs> we got an especially kind, brilliant song, Mr. Andy Serkis. The incredibly talented Denai Guerrero. Yes! Yes! Come through the dress, honey! Come through! Yes! 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 <laughs> Next up, a living legend. A living legend. A man with the most incredible stare I've ever seen in my yes. life. Sir Daniel Kaluuya. Yeah. Young woman who needs 
needs no introduction. Her intellect matches her beauty. Miss Lupita Young. Oh. So guys, we just um, finished watching the movie. This movie was not a movie. It was mad. It was it's mad. mad. Tell them again. It was, it's mad. Yes. It's absolutely mad. Munch for TV. Come on. <laughs> but nah, honest to God. Favorite movie hands down. One, one lot. There was tears in my eyes. If I start thinking about it, I would cry. Uh, the movie was fantastic. Ten out of ten. I'm excited to move to Wakanda. What's uni? Like, what's uni? What's, what's like, there's a whole Wakanda, there's a whole Wakanda way for me, and I'm struggling. A whole Wakanda way for me, and I'm struggling. So, security will not let me go back inside, but I feel like just running inside and saying Wakanda forever, like, you can't stop me. The people are Wakanda inside. Forever. Wakanda forever! And just running inside, like, I can't believe it, like, I'm sure. And you can tell when people were looking back at us, like the people who didn't, you know, the people who didn't understand, you know, the ones who didn't, you know, talk about, I didn't understand the girl. Why are you getting so pumped? It's like, because this movie is like, you don't get it, you, you don't, don't get, understand. You don't get it. Yeah. Um, so I'm home now. Um, yeah, that movie was like the best movie like I've, I've probably ever seen. Like, I'm not even joking. It was so black, it was so unapologetically black. And it was just so well, it was a good black movie. Like, it wasn't half heartedly done, it was done amazingly. The tech has a techie. That tech was just, it was just blowing my mind. Like, all I know is I'm literally, like, unless my life has changed, I am going to apply to, um, I'm going to, what's the, what's the term? To, I'm applying for indefinite uh, stay in that country, but in the UK, like, I'm a, what's it called, indefinite leave. Yeah, I'm applying for my citizenship today. Today. Yeah, we didn't meet any celebrities. Um, kind of sorry I didn't meet any celebrities because like John, but I've just watched John's um, story on Insta. We weren't even that far, you know. We weren't even that far. But I guess Allah has written that we were gonna meet. We're gonna be this close. We're gonna meet in the future. I met, I met a um, Muslim boy. Okay, when I first, when I first saw Muslim Bilal. I screamed like an idiot, but we spoke it later and I apologised and we just we just spoke and I just feel like I, I rectified myself. Um, Michaela Cole was right there and I couldn't, no one would let me speak to her. Quickly spoke to Jenny. Everyone was leaving when I spoke to them. I'm kind of sorry how I didn't actually speak to people before the event, but like, I'm just trying to remain positive in it. Like, at the end of the day, I've seen the movie. I've seen the movie. It's, it's, it's literally like, I'll see it again and I'll never see movies again. I'm literally gonna take my sisters. I'm going with a black girl's tech. I will buy. I will buy the merchandise. Like I'm. I'm gonna stand this movie forever. Number two. I'm standing like. The. the. Anyway, your girl has a 9 a.m. tomorrow, and I've got pots to wash. So lol. Bye guys. <laughs>